I have six uh, weights and brands of pellets that I usually use in my 22 caliber uh, pellet rifles. Um, so I was going to show you that um, uh, the average feet per second to reach 16 foot pounds of energy for each pellet. I always like to know that because that's like 16 foot pounds is usually the advertised uh, velocity for a 22 caliber brake barrel. Um, so, anyways, with JSBs, 1.03 gram, which is also equivalent to 15.89 grain, they have to go 674 feet per second. Uh, all these are to reach 16 foot pounds of energy. So, the cross from Premier Hollow points. 710 feet per second. The JSB 18.3 grain is 628 feet per second. And the Gamma Red Fire is 684 feet per second. The H&N Fill Target Trophy Greens, <clears throat> that's the alloy. Pellets, 848 feet per second. H&N Fill Target Trophies, um, and also the H&N Fill Target Trophy Power, 701 feet per second. And remember that if a pellet's traveling 671 feet per second, whatever grain pellet is, is how many foot pounds of energy it is. So that's the magic number for that. Um, so here's how you figure up uh, foot pounds of energy for a projectile that's in grains. So let's say a pellet weighs 20 grains and it's going 500 feet per second so you take 500 times 500 so that's the speed of the pellet times the speed of the pellet times the grain okay so whatever numbers you get you just multiply that feet per second times feet per second times the, uh, the weight of the pellet so that this one formula comes up to 5 million so you take the 5 million divided by this number is 450240 and what uh, you come up with is 11.105 da 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 okay so you round that off to 11.1 foot pounds of energy <clears throat> that's what that formula would be for a pellet traveling 500 feet per second and the pellet weighs 20 uh, grams so again, it's feet per second times feet per second times the grain of the pellet. So if it's in grams, you switch it to grains and an approximate approximation is you multiply grams times 15. So if it's one gram, you just average it out to 15 grains. All right, so when you come up with that answer, whatever answer you have, you divide that by the number 450240, and that will give you your foot pounds of energy for that projectile, an approximation number in most cases.